Okay, for part two, I'm just going to go through what we found in part one again. We found that there is a, this stationary point here occurs when x equals root 5 and when y equals uh, 3 root 5 over 2. And part two says um, the function g is given by this here uh, for some domain x where x is more than or equal to k that makes a one-to-one -one function. So where is this a one-to-one -one function or where will it start being a one-to-one -one function? What value of k will ensure that we have a one-to-one -one function? And you can hopefully see from the graph that it would be a one-to-one -one function from here onwards. It's, it's not a one-to-one -one function here because it crosses through the curve twice but it is a one-to-one -one function if this part of the curve didn't exist. So it's a one-to-one -one function from root 5 onwards. So the answer is when, when x is more than or equal to root 5. So therefore, the smallest possible, possible value of k is root 5.